Excellency, Madame Denise Chishikehi, I practice it. The First Lady of the Democratic Republic of Congo and Ambassador of Merck Foundation, More Than a Mother. Distinguished partners, future health experts, Merck Foundation alumni of the Democratic Republic of Congo, distinguished media partners and winners of the Merck Foundation Awards. Thank you very much for being with us today. We are delighted to be with you here today for the first time in the Democratic Republic of Congo and I'm very happy to meet our long-term partner, mm -hmm. the First Lady of the DRC and Ambassador of Merck Foundation More Than Mother. This underscores Merck Foundation's commitment to build healthcare capacity and transform patient care in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Last time we met was during our annual conference Merck Foundation African AG Alumni 2022 that was held last November. It was indeed a pleasure to have you at that conference over last November, Excellency. During our meeting there, we discussed the impact of our ongoing programs and our future plans to scale up our partnership. For us at the Merck Foundation, our vision is everyone can lead a healthy and happy life. For 10 years, it has been our mission to build healthcare capacity, transform the patient care landscape, break the infertility stigma, empower women and support girl education. With important partners like Africans First Ladies, like yourself, Your Excellency, and furthermore, academia, ministries of health, ministries of gender education and communication of more than 50 countries, we can impact the life of people in the most disadvantaged communities in Africa and beyond. Till today, over the past years, more than 1,570 scholarships have been provided for young doctors from over 50 countries in 39 critical and underserved specialities. Many of them are becoming the first specialist doctors in their countries, including the DRC. We have provided 81 scholarships to young DRC doctors in specialities like oncology, fertility, embryology, and diabetes, and that all in the last two years. Truly a really record-breaking figure. I'm happy to share that we trained the country's first ever fertility specialist and embryologist, which is most important to transform reproductive and fertile care and women health in the public health sector. This is a great achievement in a very short time since we started our partnership in the year 2020, which was during the Corona pandemic, which, makes, which made it even more difficult to achieve these figures. Needless to say, we are looking forward to continue our program to build healthcare capacity and transform patients' care in the DRC in partnership with the First Lady and the government. Today, I'm very happy to meet all our alumni from DRC because you are the future healthcare experts in this country. We celebrate your success in finishing the scholarships and we want to acknowledge your hard work. Moreover, as you all know, we are very interested in community awareness through our partnership with the media societies and ministries of communication, education and gender across Africa. Today we are celebrating the winners of Merck Foundation Awards. I am happy to share that we have five winners from DRC for Media and Song Awards, a very impressive number, well done. Out of the five winners, two winners are from, for the Media, Merck Media Foundation Recognition Award, More Than a Mother, two winners for the Merck Foundation Media Recognition Award, Diabetes and, and Hypertension, and one winner, for the Merck Foundation Song Awards, Diabetes and Hypertension. In fact, 21 of our previous year's winners since 2020 are also joining us today. We are very proud of you all because a lot of hard work is involved in achieving these awards. Together with Her Excellency, the First Lady of DRC, we have launched eight important awards for media, musicians, fashion, designers, filmmakers, students, and new potential talents in these fields. We at Merck Foundation strongly believe in the critical role that media and art plays to create a cultural shift and to address major social 
and health issues in your communities. You are our champions. You can make a change. Be the voice of the voiceless and educate the communities about various social and health issues in Africa, such as supporting girl education, breaking infertility stigma, ending child marriage, ending GBV, stopping FGM, and also health issues such as diabetes and hypertension prevention, and not to forget to promote a healthier lifestyle. As a part of our Educating Linda program, together with the First Lady, we have provided up to now scholarships for 20 schoolgirls who are high performers but underprivileged to cover their school fees, uniform, school meals and other items. This initiative is to support them, help them to continue their school education to reach their potential and fulfill their dreams and help the country in the further development. In 2020, we have conducted our online media health training in DRC in partnership with the First Lady, Fertility Society of African French speaking countries and Media Alumni Association. I would like to thank all of you for the overwhelming report and response to this program. We should not forget the Merck Media Foundation Health Training Program is an important part of our Merck Foundation more than a mother campaign, <clears throat> our signature campaign that aims to empower infertile women through access to information, health and change of mindsets. So dear Merck Foundation partners and alumni, I'm very happy to meet all of you in person to discuss the impact of our programs on the public health sector and also to discuss this, your future impact on patient care in your communities in general. I would like to acknowledge your role as the health champions in your community and to acknowledge your collaboration with our media recognition winners who are also Merck Foundation alumni like yourself. Merck Foundation is committed to improving the lives of people. In this spirit, we will continue our efforts together with you our partners to lead Africa to a healthier and better future. Thank you very much.